cabin pressure and cabin altitude. In a normal flight in a commercial airplane, have you wondered, though we fly at altitudes above 30,000 feet, why don't we use oxygen mask? There are two types of airplanes considering pressurization. One is unpressurized airplanes, second pressurized airplanes. In unpressurized airplanes, inside cabin pressure and atmospheric pressure at that altitude is almost the same. These airplanes are certified to operate up to about 14,000 feet. At any time when the airplane pressure in the cabin drops to less than pressure, at that 10,000 feet, oxygen mask needs to be donned by a pilot to avoid adverse effects of hypoxia and affect the safe operation of flight. For longer flights, it is mandatory to have a pressurized cabin so that all passengers and crew would be able to breathe pressurized cabin air without using oxygen mask. As you go at higher altitude, atmospheric pressure reduces, hence oxygen content also reduces, which becomes insufficient to perform normal functions of human body. Jet engine compressor increases the pressure of the air when air passes through it. This air is conditioned by air conditioning packs to provide high pressure supply of air to aircraft cabin. The altitude in atmosphere which corresponds to cabin air pressure is known as cabin altitude. Jet airplanes in commercial aviation are designed to fly up to an altitude of about 40,000 feet above mean sea level, whereas the cabin altitude maintained is about 8,000 feet.